Hey, welcome back everybody. This is going to be a quick video. I just wanted to give you guys an update on the uh, CVS DoorDash uh, altercation that I discussed with you guys a few days prior. And it seems that the CVS manager has now been let go from her job. Uh, so far, I've only been able to hear this from one source. I've not been able to find any other news articles on it. Uh, but the source, I believe, is a reliable one. It's from Derailed News and Podcasts. That was the same YouTuber who brought us the 25-minute uh, interview with the DoorDash driver herself. And he put up an update video uh, basically saying he got this information from the DoorDash driver. So let's take a look. Hey, what's up, everybody? Sorry about the informal nature of a cell phone video, but I'm out of town for the next couple days. But I did want to give you a quick update on this DoorDash delivery driver versus CVS manager story that we've been talking about the last week. So I just got done talking to B, and she said that CVS has just gotten back with her and told her that the CVS manager is no longer employed by CVS. Now, they didn't provide any further details. Obviously, a lot of that stuff's confidential. But I did want to share that information with you because many people have been saying, why was, uh, why was B let go from DoorDash, but CVS hasn't done anything? So, I mean, that's basically it. Um, it, you know, it, it looks like the, the CVS manager has been fired. I remember from um, the Reddit post that went viral, uh, a CVS district manager was aware and then in Derail's interview with the driver, she had shared with us that it, the, the CVS district manager had reached out to her and had um, explained that in the surveillance footage, they did see the CVS manager receiving the food. Um, and she also said that the CVS district manager had mentioned that she was appalled or most disappointed in the fact that the CVS manager was not wearing her mask correctly. So there's no word really on why or what the reason CVS gave as to why they let the manager go. But I think it's fairly safe to say that it's tied directly with the DoorDash confrontation. And I just wanted to give you guys some closure on that. So just a quick video. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe. See you guys on the next one. Thank you.